level. She was like Bane from Batman. She had that mask on yeah. and her muffled her voice, but she was having a good time. And now that her results are in, it's time to talk nutrition. Let's about. do it. Karma is live in Sacramento to tell us how we can tailor our eating habits to help us reach our overall health and fitness goals. Good morning, Karma. Good morning. And here with us, of course, is Karina Knight, who normally joy joins us in our own studio kitchen. And so it's so much fun having her in our studio kitchen. However, we are in her kitchen Welcome. this morning, her beautiful home. So thank you for having us. And we wanted to talk about how we can sort of use the information that we learn about the way our body works to eat more efficiently. In doing the test yesterday, I learned that my body doesn't work at all exactly. like I thought it did. And so I gave my information to Karina and I said, okay, so take a look at this. And based off of that, you know, what would you recommend for me? So tell us what you learned. So from what we learned is that you efficiently burn carbs. So it's okay for you to have some carbs in each meal and not all carbs are the same. So we want to have like good fuel for you. So for example, you can have like one slash of the non bread that's whole wheat, no sugar added and all pure ingredients and you mix it with a healthy fat. So that way you will fuel it. And if you exercise and so forth, you can still reach your goal either to lose weight or maintain your weight. Okay, so that was actually uh, something interesting uh, that we learned. Uh, we wanna show you a little bit of the video of the scanning that we did yesterday that basically uh, scanned all your body fat, your muscles, and also some testing showing how how efficiently you burn, more specifically, your metabolism and how efficiently you burn calories and whether you even burn more fat exactly. or more carbohydrates. And so based on that, you said uh, maybe a low carb diet isn't necessarily what I should be pursuing. Right, it wouldn't work for you because you won't uh, efficiently burn those, those calories. Now, for you, you can have this for breakfast. If someone that doesn't efficiently burn as carbs like you do, you would have something lower in carbs like just some lean protein, vegetable, fruit, and fats. And for you, I have some uh, some other ideas like this wrap. So I was telling you about this one, but I love it because it's only like 120 calories and it has high protein. So this is from the Lavash. So you would add some protein to this. You can add shredded chicken and you can have your wrap and let's not let's reuse ingredients. So for dinner, you can have like a stuffed potato, stuffed sweet potato to have more vitamin A and you can mix it up with high fiber foods. And we're talking about if you would exercise or not. Like, so if you wanna exercise and if you're running a marathon or so forth, you do wanna fuel up on your carbs because those are the ones that are gonna give you energy after you have spent all of your immediate energy from the carbs you eat at that time. Okay, so the last takeaway that we, we have from this and speaking with you and doing the testing that we did yesterday is that people don't necessarily fit a mold. Exactly. So, well, I've been setting my diet based on sort of an internet metric that told me I should be eating about 1400 calories a day. And apparently that would be starvation mode. For yeah, me. that would be starvation <laughs> mode. So that's why you don't lose weight. So you need to go close to your resting metabolic rate. That's what you need just for basic functions of living. So if you go below that, you will lower your metabolism. Okay, fantastic. So on our website, we're gonna have how you can follow up with Karina and uh, learn more about nutrition and even learn more about the testing that we did yesterday that was able to help me find out what actually uh, I do burn and how my body actually works because for everybody, it's different, not a one size fits all. Definitely eye-opening, great information, guys. Reporting live, I'm Karma Dickerson, Fox 40. Great segment, Karma. Karina is such a wealth of knowledge. We're lucky to have her. Yeah, absolutely. You gotta get, you gotta eat right, and you gotta do it in great weather, right, Adam? Oh yes. And we